Mercedes Manis, a community and leadership development student at the University of Kentucky. I am currently enrolled in CLD 495, New Media Application. Throughout the duration of the course, we have focused on how media is shaping the world around us, especially new media. Today, I would like to introduce you to a new, very popular site, Pinterest. Founded in March of 2010, Pinterest has become a go-to site. Pinterest is different from most other social media websites. Though the website does focus on photo sharing, Pinterest CEO Ben Silverman describes the company as a catalog of thought that inspires users to go out and do something, which is exactly what Pinterest does. Users who must register to use the site can add and search for pins, which are images, videos, etc., that usually link through to a tutorial. Pins can be collected through topic-specific boards. Users can connect with one another through following each other's boards. Today, I will show you how to save a pin to a Pinterest board. The first step is to sign into your account. It's fairly easy to create one. Just add your email address and create a password and you're set. So I'm gonna go ahead and log in. Okay, so after logging in, you'll be taken to your home page, which is a feed of topics you usually search or pins from people's boards that you follow. So for example, I usually use Pinterest to utilize new hairstyles or recipes. Um, so my feed is going to be full of images of both of those things that you can kind of see here. You'll see at the top of the screen, there's a search bar. From here, you can type in nearly any subject and find hundreds of pins. I'm going to search for grilled cheese recipes. Right there at the top. Then hit enter. Obviously, grilled cheeses are a pretty hot topic. Look at all the options we've got here. At the top of the screen, under the search bar, are other descriptors that might help you narrow your search. So, for example, I'm also a huge fan of bacon, so we'll click there. Um, you can see that Pinterest has refined my search to include all pins that contain four words in the search bar. So, this bacon avocado grilled cheese looks pretty good. Let's say this one. So, you're just going to click on the image itself. You can see it here. And you're going to hit save up in the corner. So um, when you save a pin at Pinterest, you have to save it on a board, and those are usually specific to the topic that you're covering. Um, so we're going to hit create board, and then you can put anything that you want, anything created, but I'm just going to go with something simple like food. Okay, and then you can hit enter. All right. Um, Pinterest users utilize boards to organize their pins. Um, and you can always access your board by hitting the little person silhouette up here and scrolling down. And there you go. So um, get to searching.